Okay, welcome to the Aaron's Property Q&A session. <laughs> okay, forget about the hand sign. Uh. <laughs> okay, so anyway, I started the Q&A again. And I put up the link in my Telegram group, okay? And if you don't know, uh, we are about to hit 5,000 subscribers on YouTube. So, uh, please subscribe. Uh. You all watch and don't subscribe. 50% of the people watch and don't subscribe. And don't be stingy. If you watch my video, you think it's good, hit the like button. Like button, like button, okay? No? Okay, so uh, the Telegram group got about 1.2 uh, thousand uh, subscribers already. Thank you very much, okay? And if you are agent, please don't join my Telegram group, uh, okay? Telegram food is for my consumer and my customer only, okay? Okay, so this uh, Q&A session uh, will be very interesting because my idea is try to break down, then put question by question so that you all can go and watch video question by question, okay? So in today's Q&A session, First of all, we're gonna answer some, uh, we're gonna answer some question in a way whereby, like for example, this guy, uh, thank you for submitting your question. Pen rolls at thousand eight per square feet, still can buy or not? Hey yo, <laughs> you got this kind of question? Don't send me lah. I told you already, I won't, uh, I won't answer this kind of question. You want this kind of question, you engage me as your agent, then wow, you get all the insider info, okay? So today's question, we will answer this question by KC, okay, KC. Any advice for young couples looking to settle down in the next one to two years but unable to afford private property? BTO timeline is too long for them, but at the same time, HDB prices are at all time high. Not sure is if waiting for cooling measure would make sense. Okay, so I'm gonna answer this question by KC. Okay, KC, you don't really need to buy private property. And if you need to be frank in the market now, I will tell you that you can go for a two beta and there's still some good buys around. When I say good buy means you can earn money and uh, cheap. But like you say, if you cannot afford, uh, how? Okay, so we go back to the question. Sorry. Uh. Okay, BTO. BTO timing very long, okay. So BTO timing very long because it takes about four to ten five years to build lah. So can I say that if you say BTO timing very long, EC new launch timing also equally long for you, okay? So let's say all these things all long 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 and then you say HDB prices is high. My answer to you today, KC. First, go and calculate how much grant you can take. Because if you say you are first timer, your income not very high because you cannot afford this, cannot afford that. It's okay, no problem. Because in Singapore, we have our great uh, Singapore government that will help you and provide you with, uh, I think, a proximity grant, CPF housing grant, as well as an EHG, enhanced housing grant. So you can get a lot of grant, a lot of grant, a lot of grant up to, I think, about 100,000 if I'm not wrong. It depends on your income. For me, I will find out how much grant I can take first, okay? Because the grant is a privilege and is a, it's a good thing. I take first, I go and buy resale HDB. Even if in any way the resale HDB drop price in the next few years, the price drop is dropped on the grant that the government give me. It's not dropped on my own money. That's how I see it. Lah. That's how I see it. When I say buy, lah, first of all, I will answer this question in a very clear way. Do you need to buy? Need are not one. Because if you say I can wait, then of course you don't have the need to buy. You know, you can wait, you can wait, you can wait. Everybody say you can wait. The thing is, my answer la, to your is, those people that can wait is you can wait how long? Correct or not? What if wait, 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 wait. Then the price up, 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 up. You wait never come down. And by the time you cannot wait, you need la, the price drop. Okay, so this one uh, nobody can answer la, because uh, nobody knows when is the next cooling measure and nobody knows whether there is a cooling measure and nobody knows when the price will turn or whether the price will turn or the price will stay stable. So my question again is very simple. When the price is going up now in the market, is there HDB resale that is very affordable? My answer is yes. Is there still HDB resale that has no COV? My answer is yes. Uh, is it still able to find good buys around my answer is yes so the thing is first find out the grant second go and understand what is good buy what still can buy what will not drop too much when the market collapse don't buy that kind of product uh, or that kind of like 
a uh, uh, very expensive HDB that would drop when the price come down. Uh, I never say anything. I never say anything. Okay, <laughs> if I don't buy that kind of OO one also lah. So there is still good things around. Okay, if you buy the right thing, you don't need to scared price drop. And also you have the government grant to help you. If in case drop the most drop, government grant never affect your own money and the own down payment they put in ah. So uh, this is my answer to you. Okay, so I hope this helps you. Uh, again, like, subscribe so that every time there's this a Q and A that I put up, uh, y'all can go and y'all will be notified. Ah, uh, and also I think you need to press the bell one. Ding. No, what's oh, a bit sausia. Sorry, sorry. So the ding, you never put the ding, ah, uh, then you won't get the notification, ah. Uh, okay, don't be selfish, okay. Even you are agent, I know a lot of agent watch. Y'all watch, ah. Uh, y'all learn so much, ah. Uh, you never give me back anything, right? You also never come and join my team. So the only thing they can do is help me like lah. You don't subscribe, at least you like, okay? Bye bye.